Hey everybody, Will here, and am I in a different shirt? Because apparently when I press record the first time around, it didn't record my intro and unboxing of the OBS bot. Maybe. But, hey, thanks for joining me on this video because today we are talking about the OBS bot Tiny. This is a tiny AI tracking webcam, and it is absolutely fantastic. I hope you enjoy my initial review of it and kind of demo of all of the cool things it can do. If you're not familiar with this, this is about $200 on Amazon, or you can go onto their website, obsbot.com, and uh, pick one up for yourself and check out the other cool things that they are designing. Now, if you're not familiar, OBSBot is a gimbal webcam with AI tracking software, so it can track a user as they walk across. Now, I would probably recommend that this camera is best suited for educators or vloggers. Uh, who are doing a lot more movement or anybody doing maybe a DIY channel. I do like it. Clarity is pretty good. Microphone is eh, but hey, you know, sacrifice is where you can make them. So I have the webcam open up. It's really tiny. It's kind of cool. It sits on a gimbal, so it should track very nicely, and bumps shouldn't mess with it too much. Uh, there is software you have to download for either Windows or Mac that you can do that will allow you to use the AI tracking features. So you can see it looks really well, right? So that's pretty, pretty clear for the most part. I mean, that's definitely shooting 1080. Uh, if I want to get in its frame using the AI powered... There we go. So now I have the ability as a teacher to walk around in front of the classroom and... That's really going to follow me, isn't it? That's really cool. So I've hit finally its final range. It almost has a full 360 degree range of motion. As I'm walking back and forth, it's tracking me. It's keeping me in frame pretty dang well. You got a nice tour of my basement there too. So that's a little gross. Sorry about that. Uh, now, the cool thing is you do have hand gestures when you are the presenter. So if I hold my hand up here, that's going to turn off the AI tracking itself. So you can see I can walk out of frame. That's not tracking me. Or if I need to turn it on and on the unit itself, there's actually a light that will turn blue. There we go. It's almost like a loading bar light that shows up for it. That's really cool. Okay, and then the other thing you can do, so if I'm, if you're really far away, for instance, like this, you hold up an L, it's actually going to zoom in on you here, you can zoom out, zoom in, there we go, and then it should track you with the zoom in place. So, I mean, you get really excited in class. You move around. Hey, so if you lose it, it's going to freak out a little bit. Find you. Honestly, that's kind of cool. So let's zoom it back out. Come on. There we go. That is really nifty unit. So for $200, I actually think this is, sorry, I got crazy hair there. I think this is a great uh, webcam to be putting into classrooms, or even if you're a vlogger that you need to move around, you don't have a camera crew, this looks well. These webcams are Zoom capable. Uh, it's just like a normal webcam. You can throw them into OBS if you want, if you're doing any sort of live streaming stuff. Uh, really any software that utilizes a webcam it will work for. This was my review of the OBS bot. It's a pretty nifty little webcam, $200 on Amazon. I think it's actually definitely worth picking up. The clarity looks pretty good. And um, if you're looking for something a little more higher end, if you're doing vlogs, if you're teaching, if you're trying to do tutorials, anything that requires you to move around, I'm sorry, it's just so fun to watch it track me. Uh, I recommend it. Software is pretty basic. But again, basic is better when you're trying to use, use stuff on the fly. If you found this review helpful or this look at the OBS bot helpful, please let me know in the comment section below. Let me know if you picked one up for yourself and how it's working out for you. And um, hey, 
maybe consider subscribing. It helps out this channel, Edu Center. And as always, thanks for watching.